The Lord has a message he is wanting me to release and share with his people. Please, please, please make sure you guys take this message back to the Lord in prayer. This message is actually going to be longer than I expected, so there might be a part two. But I'm just going to share with you what the Lord showed me and the scripture he used to back it up. So firstly, the Lord showed me a huge diamond ring. Like the diamond on top of this ring, y'all, was top tier. Top tier. This ring then turns to a big heart. And next thing I know, I see this angry, evil face with an upside down cross in its hair, looking at this heart, this union. And then I see a heartbeat. It was three hearts and one big heart, a medium and a small heart. It was like a heartbeat facing up. And then that's when the Lord showed me the heart wave. You guys can watch that in the previous video I uploaded. So the scripture the Lord brought me to was Genesis chapter 34. Um, I would suggest you read the entire chapter, but I am reading verse 1 to 12. And it reads, talking about how Dinah, the daughter of Leah, got defiled by this uh, guy named Shechem. He is the son of Hamar. And um, when Jacob... Dana's dad, Jacob, heard that this Shechem dude defiled his daughter. He was grieved, and so were the men in the city. Uh, and this was something that was not to be done. But the thing is, Hamar, he says that his soul longeth for Dana. This man is obsessed, okay? He is asking for Dana's hand in marriage. He is asking that he finds grace in the parents of Dana. He wants to pay her dowry and her marriage gifts. He said, I will give according as ye shall say unto me. This is verse 12. He says, but give me damsel to wife. Give me her hand to marry. I want to marry her. I am obsessed with her. My soul is connected to her. I want her. Even when he defiled her, y'all, the defiling is showing how obsessed this man was. So let's see if the parents give. 